So yeah, how was that for you? <laughs> well, um, really quite incredible. Um, it wasn't expecting it to, to feel quite that way and it's something I would definitely like to do more of. Yeah. Like really like to do more of because um, it felt like my whole energy body got a clear out because it was like it was like going back to source somehow and remembering who we are in our true essence of just pure light beings and that's how I felt like I was transcended transported into this place of of pure light mm. and obviously the lights were there supporting that but even so like initially I was just noticing all the patterns and that continued but then then it was sort of almost like I was just in the frequency somehow of those patterns and shapes and colors and lights and it was it is where we've come from and I just had this backwards sort of journey I felt like there was this like energy lasers shooting out of my hands that were just kind of really on both sides and then my whole body was lit up I felt as though um, I felt as though I also received a reminder that I chose this I chose this life, I chose this body, I chose this experience as it was part of the deal mm, yeah. of coming in to incarnate and to experience the physical because obviously, well not obviously maybe, but being up there in the light space was like going home and I really felt that. It mm. was like, it was very moving, I felt like crying a couple of times because I just felt like I was home. It didn't feel scary and then of course it reminds me also of death because it's like birth and death and source so it was just like oh yeah that's all right because that's where I'm going when I go and how beautiful is that no need to worry about you know hellfire or you know penance it's mm. like no it's beautiful it's absolutely beautiful and the thing that struck me is that it's almost like that beauty is there all the time yeah how are you feeling now compared to before you went under energized mm -hmm. uh, the heat I mean we've been in the shade but um, yeah I feel energized and alive and just clear actually would you clear. do it again oh my god I do it every day <laughs> can I <laughs> yeah if you want <laughs> I would definitely do it again 100% and the, and when I came around I was like who can I get to come and experience this because I feel that if everybody had this uh, everybody maybe responds differently I don't know you, you it's obviously it's your thing but um you know I feel like if we had the opportunity to re-experience ourselves as those light body beings and that pure brilliance that we wouldn't get so stuck in you know the minute detail of being human yeah. but then again that's also that's where that's how we learn but yeah I'd definitely do it again great for me like the way I work with the light with with groups is to release like emotions and like, yeah. like you said um, you know having a reawakening of who you are and what you are because like you said going into source right yeah it's a remembrance of you know light and what's in light but yeah all that's white light as well there was no color in that there was no color no just white light that's baffling <laughs> Really? Are there some programs with colour on? No, it's just all That's white. That's just white. And he has white LEDs. Wow. Because I was seeing this really, really like bright uh, fuchsia, like pink colour. Yeah. Really bright pink colour. And occasionally reds, but just mainly either silvery or that, that pink kept coming and flashes of green, but definitely more colours than it, it certainly was beyond white. Oh, good. Yeah, yeah. And I felt like at one point as well that it was definitely plugging into here, into the pineal, there was something just really, really expansive and, and um, intuitive about it. It's divine. Yeah. I'm going to do it again. <laughs> Can you come back next week? <laughs> sure. Same time next week. Well, thank you very much, Steph. You're welcome. Thank you. Yeah.